Today I'm, I'm Camille, I'm the, the Cloud Control 13C setup. Last time we did this uh, uh, about this and the non host, right? And now the, I'm going to talk about is the step 9 and web server as target. Oracle, uh, by now, is not only this uh, color control is not only monitor database, it is also can monitor the web server. Usually, it didn't work on web server is web logic, uh, and also, uh, you know, before there's a whole FM, uh, like uh, domains, uh, HTTP servers, uh, everything in the web logic, uh, or FM. They can monitor. We have the system user cluster, but this cluster is not really like a rank cluster. Uh, it is cluster, so they have a big IP. Uh, for the two servers, take a lot of balance. The things will be like before. The first thing is to install the, on the server side. Install the agent. Uh, we already talked about this a lot, so we are not going to spend some time how to install the agent on the host because uh, this already done for a different way. So let's directly go to the shift section. We're going to install the target for WebLogic. <laughs> If you see these steps for installation, uh, target web logic, right? The first we are today we're talking about is using auto discovery method. Before what we did, we used the manual installation. So this way will be a little bit easier to deal with. The step is very simple. The first step, you configure auto recovery, a discovery. When you set up the auto discovery, the system will be continued to discover what is new on your server side. When you set up this, Auto discovery. Any day you can log on the server side, find what is the discovery result. In the result, if something is new, you can just end that target. Okay. In order to set up the discovery, auto discovery, you go to setup and target. Also. Click on Configure Auto Discovery. Let me make it bigger. It will be easy to see. When you click on this one, you will find this window here. You click on the target on hosts. You can see they have some schedules. Say host name, right? It could be uh, how many hosts depend on their system you already did like we have like 10 more than 10 of them and then this is the host collection schedule every one day just mean every day they're going to do it and then we'll show you how many they already discovered on it and then how many already managed, right? So here is the way, when you set up this, you can see this. When you set up the auto discovery, the next one you go to the result. You click on setup and target auto discovery result. Here is one example. When you find this, 
you click on this tab, Targets on Host. When you click on it, you got a lot of list depending on how many uh, hosts you have. You can limit it to only one host. Uh, here's where I did two hosts, right? Two host web server. So total there's uh, 13 of them. And then in the list, you can add one by one some of them, like a domain that you need to uh, install one by one. But for the others, like the work of homes, this kind of target where you can click all of them and promote it. The way you're doing this is to go this way. You find one, for example, this one is the base domain in WebLogic. You select this one and click on promote. When you click on promote, the next screen, they ask you information about it. Because if this is a domain, you have the product information for login to manage it. Host name, port was populated automatically because they found it. Username usually is web logic. Password you have to provide. The unique domain identity, identity which is depends on you. Usually I use say type is base domain and with the host name become a unique one. The agent on the host they will indicate the populate you do you're not putting this agent. When you got this one, you can click continue for next page, give you a summary, but also you can click, just to click on end target. When the, if this step is okay, it's not any problem at all, you're going to get the uh, confirm, confirmation page. It will tell you, say, how many target is already succeeded and it. This is generally the way you're using auto discovery to edit one and then another servers we did the same thing when you finish this one you can see on the page right another one this is another one is a, there's a homes uh, you really they can monitor the home to see if someone deleted or removed or it's gone or still everything is fine with it. Like a home targets, you can select all of them if you wanted to uh, and then just click here, promote. When you promote, you're in that confer confirmation page. It will tell you successfully or not. If something is wrong with it, it gives you the error. Well, generally, when you finish uh, this uh, auto discover targets, you can click the close. You're done with it. Uh, that's it for today. So, uh, thanks for listening. See you next time.